My name is Aku and I'm Student Recruitment and Admissions Manager at the College of Medicine and Health. So as you know, you're going to face a multiple mini interview today. Um, some of you might have had an interview of this style already, or perhaps you've just had a look online to see what it's going to entail. Um, on the day, the waiting was a lot worse than the actual interview. The interview went by really quickly, the three minute stations zoomed by, and actually all the panellists were quite friendly, um, which was quite nice. Can you tell me why you want to study medicine at Exeter Medical School? So across one of our interview days, you may find that you're going through a series of different stations. We will employ the use of multiple mini interviews. So what will happen is you'll go through seven stations and you'll have a short period of time at each station. You will meet one panellist in each of the rooms and you'll probably have around three minutes in each room. So upon arrival, you're going to have a registration period with a few members of our staff. We'll have a look at your ID documents and get you settled in ahead of an interview briefing where we're going to talk to you about what you can expect in the interview and what kind of panellist you're going to see on that particular day. So good morning all, lovely to see you all here, thank you very much for coming. Um, over the next 10 to 15 minutes I'm just going to chat to you about what you can expect to go through in the interview and what the panellists themselves are looking for. We've got a few nervous faces in the room but don't worry at all, we are not here to be intimidated. Uh, yeah I remember having the intro uh, and you're kind of sitting around and there's a, like, a load of other uh, candidates sitting around you and it's kind of like oh my god I'm going up against all these people and you don't know anything about them because it's essentially a competition at the end of it. Yeah, so it's quite, do I want to be friendly with these people or do I want to stay isolated? So yeah, it was a bit different. Prior to your interview beginning, we'll take you to your interview location and get you settled in. We are not here to be at all intimidating with our interviews. We really just want you to be yourselves and just give us an indication of who you are as a person and what experiences you've had to date. Um, so I prepared for my interview day uh, just by really, I primarily looked online at different resources that I found. I didn't want to do too much because I wanted it to be quite natural when I sort of went into the rooms. Um, I know some people did courses and things like that, but personally I decided that I was just going to do my own research. I did a mock interview at school, but not much more than that really. Um, I remember feeling really nervous because obviously it's such a big day and um, obviously medicine was something I really wanted to do so it just mattered so much but as I sort of had a tour and like had um, a presentation done at the beginning it was just nice to just like calm down before and then went in and it wasn't too bad. <laughs> We're going to use multiple mini interviews and that's a series of short stations and you're going to have three minutes at each station. There's going to be one panellist in each room and they're going to ask you a very small set of questions and again it's mostly just about your own personal experiences and why you'd like to join the University of Exeter. Um, some students will start a medical programme but won't actually complete it. What factors do you think might cause a student to drop out from the programme? Um, probably not sort of having the experience before I feel like having work experience. If I could give a piece of advice I'd say sort of like try not to compare yourself to anyone else because it's really easy to think oh they've got all of this experience because you talked to loads of people beforehand and that sort of gets you in, can get you a bit flustered so I think really if it's something that I would take from it is don't compare yourself to anyone else and just be yourself. There's no real way to prepare for our interviews because it's just about your personal qualities and why you might like to study with us. So really just be yourselves, give us a smile and do the best that you can.